The 2021 Chevrolet Tahoe Chevy is finally revitalized as full-size SUV lineup by updating the 2021 Chevy Suburban and Chevy Tahoe. With the update comes a new exterior look that's bolder and more muscular than before, and a new interior with crazy amounts of new technology. What is arguably more important than any of this, though, are the changes that happen under the skin. Chevy made an all-new chassis, and with it comes a revised adaptive air suspension and a longer rear multi-link suspension that will drastically improve ride quality and handling abilities. On top of this, the 5.3-liter and 6.2-liter V-8s carry over, offering 355 horsepower and 420 horsepower, respectively. A new Duramax, 3.0-liter, inline-six joins the mix as well, and it offers up 277 horsepower, 460 pound-feet of torque and what Chevy believes fuel economy ratings that will meet or exceed the best in the segment. Towing figures or official fuel economy figures have yet to be released. On the inside, the biggest change comes in the passenger and cargo room departments. Since Chevy managed to stretch the Tahoe's wheelbase by 4.9 inches to 120.9 inches total, the Tahoe now offers 42 inches of second row legroom a 3-inch increase and 34.9 inches of third row legroom an impressive increase of 10.1 inches, cargo room was also increased by 10.2 CUFT to 25.5 CUFT with all the seats in place and 28.2 CUFT to 122.9 CUFT with all the seats laid down. On top of that, if you select the right trim and options, you can have up to five display screens, a standard 10-inch infotainment display optional 8-inch digital instrument cluster 15-inch head-up display two 12.6-inch rear seat displays for second-row passengers overall. Chevy has made major improvements to its full-size SUVs, and pricing has yet to be announced but don't expect prices to increase too much. The usual trim levels will carry over, including the Z71 and High Country, among others, and you'll be able to get your hands on the all-new Tahoe when it launches in mid-2020. If you liked this video, please share your thoughts in the comments below and don't forget to hit the subscribe button.